What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we went straight to the lighthouse, defeated everybody, and uh, managed to get quite a few things. On top of that, we got an evolution that is our Fluffle. He finally evolved. And uh, we, yeah, we completely forgot about an item that we uh, desperately needed, and that was, uh, yeah, you know. The experience here. Yeah, completely forgot about that. Anywho, in this episode right here, guys, we're going to be going crossing the sea because we need to get to Sinewood City. Yeah, there is something that we need, and that is a medicine. So, let's go right ahead and start battling everybody. Speed battle included in all that stuff. So, here we go. Let's go, Lapras. Please surf us. Look at that. That's pretty cool. All right, bring it on. Let's see what this guy has to say. You have, you have to warm up before getting into the water. That's basic. Okay, alrighty. Let's go right ahead and take on Swimmer Simon. And he's going to be coming out with a tentacle. Let's go with a Nessie. And speed this through. Okay, so... Another... Yes, another... Yes, 24. And yes, the experience here, we actually gave that to... Uh, what was his name? Um, to Cinder, because, well, yeah, we need to... Uh, we need to level them up just a tad bit for, I want to say, I want to say going into the the next few gym battles and all that stuff. And unfortunately for us, we're going to get attacked by Pokemon stronger than us. Yeah. Okay. So let's go right here and let's go right ahead and just press the speed button and beat everybody. Okay. So in this episode, yeah, we are planning on beating everybody in this ocean right here because, well, yeah, we kind of need to. We need to level up our Pokemon and... We kind of need to take away the, the, the whole thing that once we get to the World Islands, we don't need to battle these people. So let's go right ahead and grab this, a TM-88 Pluck. This right here is a flying type move that will actually work for us. That also, uh, what was it? It also plucks in, uh, what was it called? Uh, yeah, it also plucks uh, berries and stuff. Well, from, uh, what was it called? From your opponent's Pokemon. So let's go right ahead and battle another trainer. Here we are taking on Randall. And, well, let's go ahead and speed this through. Body slam. Body slam. And there we go. Coming out with a war turtle. And let's go with Hercules. So, anywho. There, uh, there's quite a few things that we that's been going on as of lately, guys. You know, my schedule has been picking up. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's probably a good thing that we're, like, you know, we're just doing two games. At the, well, two games at a time because, well, yeah. It's gonna get it's gonna get very very busy by the time we get to I want to say the summertime. I mean football's picking up, work is picking up. Man, it's like we're 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 doing some pretty good stuff right here. But the good thing is that you're always gonna get an episode of either Pokemon Emerald or so Heart Soul Soul uh, Heart Gold Soul Silver. And uh, well, we're just gonna keep on body slamming our way. Look at that. There it is. And here comes a Shelder. Let's go with a Hercules right here and heart or horn attack right here. And yes, you can completely go defense, but no, you're not going to beat us right here. Look at that. Okay, so let's go ahead and move on right here. Who is next? There's going to be quite a few trainers, and here we are in Route 41. So we're going to take the opposite way in Route 41 because there are more trainers around this area. And, well, trainers can be from one place to another. And... Yeah. Okay, so let's go right ahead and start taking on this guy right here. So here we go. Charlie's coming out with his shelter. And, well, let's go right ahead and go for a body slam. And, yes, this Pokemon is paralyzed. Seriously, these icicles. Why do these Pokemon go with, like, you know, these moves, like these repetitive moves? It's, it's so annoying. So let's go with Togepri. Togepri, how's it going? It's extra sensory. And just like that, bam. And he's coming out with a Tentacruel, so let's go right ahead and go with that extra sensory. This is actually going to be a good battle for my Togepi. And look at that, level 26. And there we go. We have defeated another Pogemon trainer. It's probably a good it's probably a good idea to just battle everybody, guys, because you may never know what you might get. On top of it all, for those new trainers that are coming into this game, you might not know your way on uh, which which island is the the right island to actually get the Pokemon that you're looking for. And that, that Pokemon I'm talking about is, uh, what was it called? Uh, that Pokemon that we're talking about is Lugia. And, well, let's go right ahead and go with Fluffolt right here. Let's go with a Thunder Punch, as you guys may remember. 
Last episode, this Pokemon, this majestic Pokemon right here has evolved. Pretty good Pokemon right here. So, there's another trainer. Let's go right ahead and battle him. And, well, let's go right ahead and speed it up. Krabby, how's it going? Surf attack for the win, and bam, okay. Let's see, who is next? Okay, so we, we can cross that, but I kind of want to see what's uh, below this island right here. There could be another trainer, maybe one or two. And, yes, our repel has worn out. And, well, let's go right ahead and use another repel. And let's see what we got. There's nobody, but now you guys can see there's these whirlpools right here. Eventually, once we get the whirlpool HM, we will be able to cross these, uh, these whirlpool areas. Now, the other thing, too, is that if you choose to do this early on... Well, if you choose to do this early on, uh, you won't be getting very, very far because in the World Islands, there are a few areas right there where you can actually... You actually need access with both a surf technique or waterfall technique, and, well... It will take until the very end that you, you know to get to a waterfall, so you guys got to keep an eye out for that. And look at this. Full full is kicking some butt. Look at that, level 31. And here comes another Gyarados. So let's give somebody else a little bit of a love. Let's go with uh, Hercules right here. All right, horn attack. Eight aerial ace. Horn attack. And aerial ace, there you go. And well, that was a pretty tough battle right there. But there it is, guys. We have defeated this guy. I wonder if we... Well, we don't have the VS Seeker right here, so that's kind of a shame. That guy could have been a, a very, very good uh, very good opponent, opponent to actually train our Pokemon up a little bit. So let's go ahead and give these Hyper Potions to these guys, and bam! There you go. And, well, what is next? Let's go right up here. And there is another trainer waiting for us, and she's going to be like... Huh, huh. If you need a rest, you just tread water. You'll get your breath back when you can keep on going strong, keep on getting strong. So there it is, guys. We're going to be taking on the next trainer. How's it going? Swimmer Caro wants the battle. Here comes Staryu, and, well, let's go straight for a surf attack, even though it's not very effective. And she's going to be coming out with a Starmie, so let's go straight for a Flood Volt. And go with a Charge Beam. And just like that, we have defeated this guy. Or this chick, I should say. Okay, so here we go. This guy's looking for somebody. And see, see those islands that are blocked by whirlpools? They're just there. Uh, there's, or there just has to be a secret. There is a secret. A big old secret. Alrighty. So here we go. Taking on Swimmer Burke. And well, here we are. Taking on the Quillfish. Let's go with a surf attack. It's coming out with a rollout attack right here. Holy buckets. And well, look at that. Okay, so Quillfish. You want to battle, so let's go with Thrasher right here. Let's go with a dig attack, and there it is. That's right. How's it feel to fail? Okay, so let's see. Um, do we have... Do we have a revive? Crap baskets, we don't have a revive. We do not have a revive. Okay, so we kind of screwed the pooch right there. Uh, yeah. Okay, so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be fast forwarding to or we're going to be buying some repels and all that stuff so i'll be right back with you guys <laughs> okay so let's see what kind of items our mom got so here's one we got a cassie berry i'm kind of waiting on some pretty good ones so that's a good berry and let's see what this one is uh we got walking berries okay so it looks like to me we got a bunch of berries and here's another one and uh we got charty berries huh Okay, so I'm assuming it's just one more, right? Oh, we got another one, and we got ourselves a Moonstone! Huh! Well, wow, that would have uh, actually helped us out and all that stuff. So that was four. And, well, here we go. Look at that. We get some more stuff from our mother. So she bought us a quite a quite a bundle. So, yeah, we got quite a few things. We got a Moonstone, which we could have used for, you know, our good old buddy, but we weren't going to wait that long. Anywho, let's get back to the sea. I'll be right back with you in a bit. Okay, so here we are back, guys. And, well, off screen, I accidentally battled this lady because, well, I completely forgot that there's a blockage right over there. And, well, we're going to be taking on a Tantacruel right here. Well, you don't say. kind of want to capture it. So, let's go right ahead and, uh, yeah, okay. So, we're going to be capturing this Pokemon, you know, for purposes of our own and all that stuff. So, let's go right ahead and go with a Netball right here. And just like that, we cut ourselves a tentacruel. It's 89 or it's 80 tentacles or tentacles absorb water and stretch almost endlessly to constrict its prey and enemies. 
That is a pretty cool Pokemon, but we're not going to be using this guy. We're just going to be moving on, uh, moving them along the way right here. So, let's go right ahead and get attacked by more Pokemon. And oh, look at this, a Mantine. Or Mantine. I don't even know, but I'm going to capture it too. Okay. Okay, so... I'm going to try and capture it. Look at that. Okay, so this Pokemon is pretty rare. And you know what? Screw it. We're just, you know... We're here collecting Pokemon, and, well, this guy right here does not want to be with us, so let's go right ahead. And Jeebus Cramony, this Pokemon is not, does not want to come with us, so let's go ahead and use that only Ultra Ball we got. Good gravy, okay. <sighs> there is a Pokemon that it can take on, and I want to switch it to Fluffolt. I want it to make the, I want, to, I want it to make the Fatal Flaw of hitting us physically, so there we go. Come on. Come on. Hit us. Hit us with your headbutt. There we go. Oh, crap. Basket has wing attack. Come on. There it is. Okay, so now it's paralyzed. Okay, so let's go right ahead and throw another ball at it. Let's go with the great ball right here. And god dang it. So, yeah, this Pokemon will not. Will not want to. It does not want to be caught. So, let's go with the heal ball. Jesus. Okay, so. Here we go again. Oh my god. Okay, so it is literally taking all our Pokeballs. All our rare Pokeballs. Uh, quick ball. It is fast. And oh my god. I hate you. Hate you with the bloody passion. So here we have five or like four specialized balls and. Oh my god. Okay, so. Yeah, this Pokemon is. Okay, screw it. I, I don't want to capture it. Let's go. Thunder Punch. Eat a dick. Okay, there you go. But yes, you can find yourself a man, a man time right here. Doesn't want to be caught or anything like that. So let's go right ahead and move on with our lives because Mantine does not want to be captured. And here we have another trainer. And the weather is so beautiful, I'm in a daze. Hmm, you don't say. Okay, so here we are taking on swimmer Denise. And she's coming out with a seal. Let's go straight for a good old body slam attack right here. Look at that, level 25. And I don't think any Pokemon are going to try and attack, attack us right now. But here we are in on the border of, or on the shore, close to the shore of Sinewood City. We just need to look for other Pokemon right here. Or Pokemon trainers, I should say. So let's go north and see who else we can actually find. I'm pretty sure there's just one more. And, well, of course, we're going to get attacked by Pokemon because, well, we're still level 25. And here she is. She says we look so elegant riding on our Pokemon. Yes, we do. Say goodbye to Psyduck. And here we go again. And there you go. Cinder grown to level 34. And, well, that is pretty much it right there, guys. I'm, I'm pretty sure that, you know, that's <laughs> all the trainers right there. So, let's get the heck out of here. Well, it has been an adventure. Here we are in Sinewood City, guys. And I know what you guys are thinking. But in the next episode, yeah, we will be taking care of all the stuff that you can actually find here in Sinewood City. Believe it or not, Pokemon Heart Gold, Soul Silver, they've included quite a few things. That way you can actually explore a little bit more since it was so bland in the very beginning. So thank you guys again for being patient. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode as we explore Sinewood City. See you guys.